So what's up everyone? This is your boy TGP and today well I already did the battle basically just uh, I didn't have time to do it before like the preview uh, the preview of the battle the actual battle I went live uh, like uh, the, the, sh the day of the championship of the, the uh, Oceania International by the way I don't know if you watch it at the moment I think is the junior TGC TCG sorry but that's not what we are here today and today we're here because I'm doing a draft league in single and double on Pokemon World League and uh, basically I d one of my favorite starter like is it is Greninja so I decided to go for the Greninja Montreal and I'm facing Milton Keynes Melolatas and uh, yeah so this is my team so I draft pretty good months uh, I have a lot of similar similar uh, weaknesses like I have two weak two fairy weakness uh, two fairy weaknesses I have triple ice weaknesses and uh, triple uh, fighting too but that's that's not that much of a problem because I got pretty good counter for that and uh, yeah so this is my team Avalog I love Avalog like even it because of the ice typing that's not a problem Gloxire absolutely a beautiful man like a good one Dragapult is one of my favorite too Floris like is an underrated man in my opinion like for sure if you have a steel type Floris can do nothing but with Terra Fire you can do stuff but mine doesn't have Terra Fire so well whatever and uh, after that we have Knuckle Stack I wasn't able to get the Gargonicle so why not take the knuckle stack and Sandaconda that's my boy from uh, the uh, what we call sword and shield is uh, free another underrated man he can do stuff but uh, not a lot of people know that or not used to that and Venomot like basically the battle free with Tintin less can be way can can do a lot of stuff and I have a palafin like all might that 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 Pokemon did a lot like you will see in the video and I have Sinisty because I, I needed to take a, a like a not fully evolved mon not a uh, sorry not a little cut mon and uh, we have Umbreon so what he got in his team so as you can see he got Annihilate that's a menace Espratra another menace you get SPN that can be a bit of problematic because I can if I want to set up the rocks or set status like toxic yawn with Umbreon or toxic with uh, Clogsire uh, stuff like that if I want to put the rocks with Clog or Sandaconda or even the slip powder with uh, Venomat that can be a bit of problem uh, Frostmod can be a problem too because uh, like I said I have triple weakness to ice with Dragapult, Clogsire and Sandaconda and uh, he can manage the uh, the Avalog too because Avalog got a huge physical defense like I think 184 but uh, the special defense is like six, uh, 56 I think something like that and uh, the, the frost mod with ice skill can handle the forges can handle uh, Poltergeist uh, not Poltergeist but Sinisty and even the uh, uh, Venomot and can do a super f uh, if you get Giga Drain or uh, for the Knuckle Stack, Bug Buzz for the uh, Umbreon. So it can be a problem. Cloth, uh, I don't see anything like Cloth can be manageable by with the uh, Sandaconda or Knuckle Stack. That's not a huge deal. Mudbray, too, I can manage it pretty easily uh, with Palafin, too. Pinker chain can be something interesting because you can stop uh, my uh, Venomot with the uh, electric terrain but uh, yeah uh, that's not yeah I can still do a, a lot of damage but it'll sure be annoying and stop my uh, sleep powder Rotom fan I don't see it come in the game even if I saw the game I already did my battle but like when I was looking at my mon what to bring I didn't think that Rotom fan was a huge deal because I have the uh, Clogsire and I can just toxic and it can do a lot to me and or I can even like bring something else and like do a lot of damage so it's not that much of an issue and scissor too I can manage it like even Avalog like even if it, it is uh, weak to uh, 
to steal, I can just Terra Ghost or Terra whatever I want, even water to resist the bullet punch and stuff like that. And the toxicity, I'm not that scared because of the uh, clogs are. So for this uh, this round, I decided to go with the Dragapult, and I went with my uh, classic uh, Dragapult uh, Dragon Dance sub because I knew I can set up my uh, my uh, sub in front of uh, like maybe Mudbray or even Pinkerchin stuff like that. And uh, after that, I needed the clog Zyre because the clog Zyre was uh, one. Like I saw a video like earlier this week about clog Zyre uh, doing like Terra Dark and be able to wall the the Espatra because Third Power won't it be able to do damage. But the Dazzling Gleam is doing like maybe thirty maximum. It was like thirty five or thirty seven percent. So I was like, yeah, that's good. I can earthquake and toxic and stuff like that and we, like the one v one, I I might be able to win against the Espatra, and also will be good against uh, Toxtricity, Rotom, Fan, and the Pinkerchin. Even even the uh, clock can or can be something. Or so yeah, I decided to go with it. I use uh, the Florges too, Florges because I can trick, you learn trick, and I can trick Scarf on any other mon if like the Espatra or even Annihilate if it caused me problem and uh, Palafin of course I need to use it because Palafin Jet Punch is the thing that can destroy Espetra, destroy Frostmod, destroy Espeon and like it's so good against so many mons so I need it like even Cloth and Mudbray it will be able to destroy them and I went with Venomut because Venomut is good for the bug boss I can manage the um, Espeon or I can sleep powder the uh, any month outside of Pikachin and then with Tintin Lens I will always do uh, at least uh, like neutral damage or minus two and uh, not minus two but uh, half damage depending if it's four time resist and uh, my last one was Sunderkunda because my set on this one was like Earthquake, Iron Head and the uh, Glare Red because with Shedkin, shed, shed Skin sorry if I rest, I have like one a uh, 33% chance to uh, be cured of my status condition. So sometimes I can just rest and like at the end of the turn wake up because of shed skin. So that's something really good, and you can manage the scissor claw, even the the analape on certain extent. And so yeah, I needed that. So this is the crew. So the crew: Clogsire, Dragapult, Florges, Polyphon, Venomod, and Sundaconda. So that's the team. So, into the battle. So, week one, single drive for Pokemon World League. I'm facing Milton Keys Meloletas, whatever the name is. So, I knew Espertra will be here. The uh, what we call Toxicity was a choice. Scissor and Inelape, too. So, that's good. I got stuff for the my whole team is built for them so <clears throat> so I think I can lead with the uh, Venomoth but the Pikachu can be a problem so I think I will lead with that All right, so good luck, have fun. It's time. So can go for the glare only the chain and the uh, what we call uh, toxicity can be paralyzed so if you decide to go for the uh, espatra that will be perfect
right, so... I think I can go safely for Earthquake here. Oh. So I think it is a fully uh, physical, like maybe max HP, max attack. Because it did like maybe a, almost a half with Earthquake. So no bulk in defense. And I was faster with the glare, so. Oh, early Terra? Maybe we'll go for poison? No, oh, water, okay. Mm -hmm. Of course. Oh. I think I can go now for the uh, Kalaxire. Or maybe Earthquake? That's good. Wow, we did way too much. Ah, oh, I should have recovery right here, man. Ah, oh, that really was a really bad play, man. I should have recovered. I saw the life orb. But at the same time, regardless what he will bring in, I can manage. Mm. I'll go for recover. So I'll go for substitute. If my Dragapult was special, the the uh, what we call annihilate will not will not have been a big problem. So let's go. And maybe we'll try to do bulk up. All right. So now it will be a battle of the. We can stay longer, I guess. I'm not sure if he's aware that I'm unaware. Maybe we'll think I was water up so because I bring in the I bring in front of the uh, scissor. All right, so he switched. That's good. Now I'm scared because, okay, so herbal. Okay, that's good. Oh, no, that's not good, because I can't touch it. So let's go for the... That's the only thing that I can touch with uh, my, uh, what we call, clogs iron. Okay, so the side shock will do a lot of damage. Way too much. So I think I don't have any choice but to trick. Oh, never mind. Not fast enough. Well, I guess I can go for at least one Quiver Dance and go for Buzz Bug. Or maybe it will call my bluff. You never know. Yes. 
All right, so that's good. That's good, that's good. So we're still in good shape. Let's go for another one. Maybe I'll decide to lay some spikes or hazard. Oh, memento. That wasn't ideal for him, I guess, because now he doesn't have anything to counter the, uh, the uh, what we call the sleep pounder or something like that. So now either it will go for the substitute again. Oh, come on. Damn. Or maybe now I can go for the morning sun and try to us the stall the uh, terrain. And with um, the, the damage did, like for sure the Rage Fist won't do anything because I never touch it yet. So does the terrain will be down now? I don't know. Maybe next turn? Oh, so it was the uh, expanding uh, ex uh, terrain extender. Like. So let's go for another Quiver Dance. I'm playing with the fire at the moment because the Paralyze can mess me up real good now. So I got Bulk Up, Substitute, Rage Fist, maybe Drain Punch the last move. I think I need to attack right now. Oh, damn it. It is the last turn. Oh, okay, so let's go for Bug Buzz. So now we kill. A knee leap is really a bad, like a difficult one to manage in general. So let's go for Clogs Eye right here. So Rage Fish is only at uh, 100 because I hit it once. So I think I can go for Stockpile right here. I forgot the set, the EV spread on my Clogs Eye though. All right, that's good, that's good. The only problem I have at the moment is if it decide to go for the uh, Espion. Because of the, uh, what we call the balloon. The balloon really, really something I can't play against. Oh, okay, I can think that. I 
I don't know why I knew like my four deaths I should have put it max special attack max speed but I put it in more defensive way so that's my mistake so again that thing need to I need to pop the balloon on this thing I think what I can do is go for the... Maybe I have to switch on the... I will switch on Dragapult. Like this I can go Fortune and Force. Either I kill the Espeon and do a lot of damage on the uh, Annihilate. And Psyshock should not kill me. You should not. Oh. But it did a lot of damage. Okay. Let me try to do one substitute at least. If I can do one, that would be good. Oh yeah, perfect. So now we're back in, in the game. Ah, oh, maybe we'll go for some... Uh, what we call snarl or overdrive stuff like that so let's go for phantom first right here maybe i'll be able to tank the next uh, one so overdrive maybe i will be able to ma to resist to, to live the overdrive or maybe I should, I should have attack right away. Oh, uh, let's go live. You can live it. Damn it. So let's go for Palafin. Yeah, perfect, okay. I think I should switch right now. Bring back the uh, Pelophon. Uh, so maybe we'll do some uh, substitute. I think I should not have done the... Oh shit. I should have attacked uh, with the uh, Dragapult right away. Let's go for one bulk up. If you go for substitute, I will just go for taunt. Okay, so you decide to go for... I need my uh, Palafin because uh, if I can hit the uh, the Espeon, I'm pretty I'm screwed though. So that's that's pretty simple.
Let's go for town right here. Maybe I should throw it right here. I don't have any choice now. Let's go, Polyphon. You're my only ult now. So now it will hit like a 120 jet punch with plus two. If I get a crit, that can be nice. Not enough, but maybe I will tank the rage fist. I need. Oh, yeah, perfect. Oh, nice, nice, nice. Uh, nice, nice, nice. So I think. Espatra and Espion will die from one hit of Jet Punch, Terra Boosted, and plus two. So let's go, Palafin, my boy! You need to die. You need to die. You need to die. Yes! Let's go, Palafin! Not gonna lie, I was super scared because that thing was the only problem I had with the uh, clock Zyre. Yay! What a comeback, man! Yo, that's why Falafin is so broken. Woo! So yeah, thank you for watching everyone. For people watching live, if you if you watch a recording, I will do some editing um, for the beginning. So thank you for watching. Have fun and stay liquid.